My name's Winston Wright. We've been working on this for about five years. Hey, the TRW 17 rotary woofer. This is it. It's the actual evidence of its functionality is it's next door at the Marriott and Home Theater. Right. And uh, what we're playing there is that we have found low frequency content in about 30% of the modern movies, right. which are digitally encoded. Mm -hmm. uh, also, there's uh, some electronic pipe organ music that was uh, done with these woofers. Uh, they wanted a 32 foot and a 64 foot stop, so we gave them that, that 16 hertz and that 8 hertz capability. Yep. Uh, we did. We put six of them at Niagara Falls Welcome Center for a uh, a special effects panoramic screen uh, a table rock house venue. There's a couple home theaters here in the Bay Area, a home theater in Florida, a, uh, a home theater in New York that's, that an engineer is putting. So the, the nuts together. and bolts of this in is your your speaker line is here. In this case, yeah, we just we hook up here, but we, in the installation, a lot of time we just hook straight to the voice pool pencil lead. Right. And uh, this. Frequency drive here is what maintains the speed of the unit, and that's constant. This frequency is, drive. It is. It, it's a constant speed motor. We use the frequency drive uh, to maintain a, a, a derated constant speed. The motor's rated for about 1,800 RPM, but we run about half that. Yeah. When the torque load on the, the motor increases due to the, the vanes pitching and the air load on the blades increasing. We consume more power into the motor. It takes about 50 watts of amplifier power for us to, to produce Portion. 110 dB when it's down to zero. So as you increase the volume to it, this collar moves here? That's correct, yeah. That, uh, and that the amplitude, the, pitch. Uh, the, the more pitch in the blades, the more amplitude you get, and the more speed through the blades, the more amplitude you get. And yeah, but you're tracking the uh, frequency response also with the pitch of the blades? Correct. The, 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 the veins follow the amplifier AC waveform. And uh, since we're coupled with the air very rigidly, they follow it very quickly. Yeah. There's not a lot of inertia to overcome. My name is Winston Wright.